typically, you know, like I mentioned before, I'd be moving a little faster. I'd probably be changing my monitor level a little bit more. I'm kind of at a pretty moderate level right now. It's a good listening level. I, I, it's not too quiet. It's not too loud. I don't, you know, when it's too loud, it's exciting, but you get ear fatigue. You you know, it's hard sometimes to judge the bass. And I find at lower levels, especially like rhythmic and transient energy, vocal levels are a bit more accurate. Sort of keeping it at a kind of a conversational level, sort of about the same volume as my voice, which is probably 75 to 80 dB. That's kind of a, a typical conversational voice level. 80 to 90 dB is a good listening range. I'm conscious of not listening too loud for too long. I definitely turn it up. I want to feel it and have that experience. And that's, you can kind of tell what's going on with your low end that way a bit more and, you know, switching speakers. So I just kind of wanted to, to let you know about that because I'm working and talking so much. I, I haven't been changing it as much as I normally would. As we get a little bit further along and I'm, I'm getting out of like such small specific segments and I'm, I start to hear the whole mix, I will be changing the volume a bit more. And especially when I put my vocal in and, and want to balance that, I'm going to, I'm going to make sure at a low level that it's, that it's very, very clear, but it doesn't feel too separate from the music. And then I'm going to turn it up loud and make sure that it's, that it's uh, not too, nothing's really piercing or poking out and that the, the low end feels full, but doesn't feel out of control. Because when you turn the speakers up loud, you start getting the room involved. And that can tell you some good things, but it's, it can also be dangerous because you're, you're hearing the space as opposed to what's strictly coming out of the speakers. To follow along at home, let's look at a decibel meter and just sort of see where my speaking voice is, what the things I'm talking about, and what volume I'm listening to. So I'm a little louder than I've been, but you know, it's averaging around 77, 78. My speaking voice actually is around 70. So I'm just listening a little bit over speaking volume. It's good to kind of monitor your level. Let's, let's turn it up to about 85. The mid 80s volume wise is, is, is a good place to listen. And I'll be there when I start doing mix moves. I want to be in that, in that 80 to 90 range because that's a very balanced decibel range in terms of loudness energy. But until I get there, I don't want to fatigue my ears. In all reality, yeah, I'm listening a little bit louder than, a, than my speaking voice. We're far from home. 